Embarking on the journey of learning to drive is an exciting milestone, yet it can be quite intimidating. But fear not, we've got you covered. We've compiled 10 essential tips to guide you on the road to becoming a skillful driver. These tips are not just about mastering the mechanics of driving, but also about fostering a safe and responsible attitude behind the wheel. So buckle up, adjust your mirrors, and get ready to explore the world of driving. First and foremost, get to know your vehicle. Understanding the vehicle's controls is crucial. Pay attention to the pedals, the accelerator, the brake, the clutch if you have one. Get a feel for the gear shift, know where it is, how it moves. Next, check out the mirrors. Make sure you can see all around your vehicle. Lastly, familiarize yourself with the lights. Know how to switch between high and low beams and how to signal for turns. Once you've familiarized yourself with these controls, you're ready to hit the road. Next, adjust your seat and mirrors. This isn't just about comfort, it's about safety. Your seat should be positioned so you can easily reach the pedals and steering wheel. Now, onto the mirrors. Your rearview mirror should show as much of your back window as possible. Side mirrors need to be adjusted to minimize blind spots. Aim for a sliver of your car in the mirror's edge. And remember, mirrors can't catch everything, so always check your blind spots. With your seat and mirrors properly adjusted, you're ready for a safer driving experience. Always remember to buckle up before driving. You see, seat belts aren't just strips of fabric. They are your first line of defense in the event of a collision. They are designed to hold you in place, reducing the risk of you hitting the steering wheel, windshield, or other parts of the car. Think of them as your personal bodyguard, always ready to protect you. Remember, safety should never be compromised. Seat belts save lives, so make sure everyone in the vehicle is buckled up. Driving can be nerve-wracking for beginners, but it's important to stay calm and focused. Keeping your cool is crucial to maintain control of the vehicle. Distractions are a big no-no, be it your phone, a sandwich, or even a chatty passenger. Anything that diverts your attention from the road has to be avoided. Your focus should always be on the task at hand, which is operating your vehicle safely. Remember, safe driving requires your full attention. Next, let's talk about defensive driving. It's an approach where you remain aware of your surroundings, always on the lookout for potential hazards. Imagine you're a chess player, anticipating your opponent's moves. On the road, that means keeping a safe distance from other vehicles and preparing for the unexpected. Maybe a pedestrian steps out or a car suddenly breaks. Defensive driving means you're already thinking about how to handle these situations. With defensive driving, you're ready to react to unexpected situations. It's essential to obey traffic laws. They're not just suggestions. They're rules set up to keep everyone safe on the road. Familiarize yourself with the laws in your area, including speed limits, traffic signs, and signals. Remember, going with the flow of traffic isn't about keeping up with the fastest driver, but adhering to the designated speed limits. Yielding to pedestrians and other vehicles when necessary is also a key part of road etiquette. By obeying traffic laws, you ensure not only your safety, but the safety of others on the road. Don't forget to use your turn signals. These little blinking lights are more than just a courtesy, they're a crucial part of communicating with other drivers. Whether you're changing lanes, merging onto a highway, or preparing for a turn, your turn signals let others know your intentions on the road. By signaling ahead of time, you're giving other drivers an opportunity to adjust their actions accordingly. This simple habit can significantly reduce misunderstandings and mishaps on the road. Effective use of turn signals improves communication and prevents accidents. Keeping both hands on the wheel is crucial. It's not just about following the rules, it's about ensuring your safety and the safety of others on the road. Picture a clock in your mind. Your hands should be at the 9 and 3 o'clock positions. This isn't just a random guideline, it's designed that way for a reason. It gives you the ability to make quick, smooth, and precise maneuvers. It's like having a superpower, the power of control. This allows for better control and maneuverability while driving. Parking can be challenging for beginners, but practice makes perfect. It's about mastering different parking techniques, each with its own set of steps. First, we have parallel parking, a common method in city streets. Then there's perpendicular parking, often found in parking lots. Lastly, we have the art of backing into parking spaces, a skill that comes in handy in tight spots. Always remember to practice in a safe and empty area. Over time, with practice, parking will become second nature. Finally, remember to take your time. 
Stepping behind the wheel for the first few times can feel like a whirlwind, especially on busy roads or highways. It's absolutely okay and in fact it's crucial to build your confidence gradually. Start off with short drives around your neighborhood or other familiar areas. This way you're not just learning to operate the vehicle but also understanding the nuances of the road. As you get more comfortable, slowly venture onto busier streets during off-peak times. It's like learning to swim, you don't jump into the deep end right away, you start in the shallow, gradually making your way deeper as your skills improve. Remember, it's not a race. Each person learns at their own pace, and that's perfectly fine. Don't rush the process. With time and practice, you'll become a confident and safe driver. So, keep your cool, take it one step at a time, and relish the journey of learning to drive.